Hi guys, hope all of you are fine. Today we are talking about Bronsted Lorry concepts of ACD and bases. In this video, we are comprehensively discussed about this topic. Uh, in the previous video, we have discussed uh, another important topic, which is called Arrhenius concepts of ACD and bases. Today we are discussing about Bronsted Lorry concept. So when we are talking about acids. First of all, we are going about the. We are going to inform you about the scientist, the Danish chemist Bronsted and the English chemist Lorry. Both are independently presents their theory on acids and bases in nineteen twenty three. In nineteen twenty three, both. Bronsted and Lorry gave their concepts independently. So they have concluded, according to them, proton donor species are acids, while proton acceptor species are called bases. Are acids and proton acceptor is called bases. This is the major theme. So the proper definition: a substance, molecular ion that can donate a proton. Donor means which can donate a proton are called acids, while a substance or molecular ion who accepts a proton. Proton means H positive in both cases. Proton is H positive, which they accept or donate. So these are called bases. Uh, and then we are going to talk about the examples, important examples. For HCl plus NH three to lone pair, they produce NH four plus Cl chlorine. So in this example, HCl donates a proton. HCl donates a proton. While NH three is a base, NH three where is NH three? NH three is a base. This is an acid. So this concept follows the Bronsted Lorry concept. Then after this, they are talking about the conjugate acid and the conjugate base. What are the difference species? Species. Conjugate acid and conjugate bases. So, a conjugate base is actually a species formed by donating a proton. After donating a proton, the product is called conjugate base. And a conjugate acid, a species formed by accepting a proton by a base. So you may also familiar with the conjugate word. Conjugate means to live together as a pair. Together. As a pair, this is all about the basics of Bronsted Lorry. Uh, after this, we are talking about Lewis concept. Uh, Lewis concept is also very important according to Zam point of view. Before going to next, we are discussing here another important topic.
is called atmospheric species and after this important topic is atmospheric species so any substance molecular and which behaves like an acid or a base is called atmospheric species so any substance behaves like an acid as well as base is called atmospheric species so this is also an important definition according to exam point of view water water is an example important example of atmospheric compound h2o also we are discussing here an example let's suppose h2o with ammonia ns3 having two lone pair after reaction they form ammonium ion nh4 positive so this is the beauty of chemistry with the hydroxide ion so as you are seeing in this example water and ammonia both are react and in the product product behaves like an acid positive and hydroxide ion negative so any species which acts like an acid or a base are called atmospheric species so this is all about bronsted lorry concept and after this atmospheric species conjugate acid conjugates base so meet up in next video thank you so much